Can cake be good for us? Please say yes. Oh, good for the soul. Yeah. It makes you feel good, doesn't it? And that is what I'm going to do today. So... We've got fruit. We've got a bit of fruit. That's good. Banana, coconut, chocolate. Double chocolate, in fact. So, really, really simple, easy weekend recipe, and I'm going to show you how simple it is. Here, we have an array of bananas. So, through to where I would just about eat one of those. That's too we much. That is borderline <gasps> old. And Ooh. that is... Oh, goodness So you I'm going to put it in a cake. You like them when they're a bit green? I do like, like that them when one. they're a bit no, I'd have yeah. to be so, 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 like a colour chart. Did you just say to me, see, I would put that in the bin. You would say... No, put in that... a cake. Yeah. Perfect for really? a cake. But look at this for a little trick. So this a uh, little trick. So if you want to peel one of those and then start mashing it, mm -hmm. if you can't get really, really ripe bananas, take one of these, yeah. pop it in the oven for 15 minutes. What, the quite green one? The bright green one. 15 minutes. 15 minutes and, and about 150. Look at that. So if you want to peel and you'll see, if you want to peel and then mash both, both of, of those. those, that would be lovely. And I will get started on the other bit. Oh, I love the smell of bananas. But see, I like them right, quite ripe because they're sweeter. Mm -hmm. Yes, they are, and that's the difference. Yes, that apron is especially for you, Eamon. Oh no, What's Ruth, got? it looks yeah, like darling. it's coming. Oh, I've got an apron. Yes, you're getting these squidgy things rising here. <laughs> So in this bowl, I've got plain flour. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Guess what you've so, done? What are you doing? It's well, the wrong way round. It's going to go around your waist, does it? There. All oh, right. There we okay. go. So well, plain the flour. They're very smelly, aren't they? They're they lovely. are. When they're that, they are, and that's why I can't eat them. I don't like it when you can smell them. So they're perfect for a cake. But this is just literally. I've got very little time, and it's just how quick and easy this cake is. So two ripe bananas, or specially ripened ones. Then yes, plain flour, cocoa, uh, bicarb and baking powder. But there's then, your very ripe, that's your I know. cooked one. That is Desiccated really coconut, brown sugar for that caramel flavour, soft melted butter, and because it's really warm in here, the butter is perfectly soft, which is fabulous. Do you know the you say you put that in the oven for 15 minutes? Mm -hmm. Could you put it in the microwave for I've five I've not minutes? tested that, so if anyone wants to test okay. that and let me know what okay. happened then. So, one egg. And then we're going to put this on. I'm going to try not to cover everybody. The only person that will be OK if that happens is... Uh, you want me to dress you, you in a, an apron, a banana apron? In a banana on. apron. I think we've only got the one. Yeah. So, Ruth, if you want to just pop that in there for me... Oh, hang on. Sorry. ..with a splash of milk. But it's worth remembering that when the riper the bananas are, the more sort of liquidy they are. So, um, splash of milk makes it nice and moist, which is what we want from a cake. Mm -hmm. This cake is really, really forgiving. Eamon, just while I do this, can you peel me either one of these yes. or one of these and slice it lengthways in half? Do you understand that instruction? Yes, because... And I think I'll use a hard one because I think it'll be easier to slice. Okay. Eamon's right. down to the hard one. Yeah. Perfect. Right. Okay. So, so while Eamon does that, I'm just going to scrape this into my lined and greased tin. I like being your assistant. Oh, I like you being yeah. my assistant. I, I like it. This, I think this could work. I'm not very good at baking and I'd like to learn. <laughs> So that goes in like that. And when Eamon has sliced that lengthways, lengthways, oh. that's oh, okay, we can I do just... it in halves. What kind so of length? What kind of lengthways? Cut in half. Lengthways <laughs> half. <laughs> 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 One job. One <laughs> job. Perfect. There right. we are. What look. we'll do is we'll stick it together so no one will know. So that just goes on the top like that. Yeah. Oh, that's so perfect. When it cooks, yeah, it. You don't do you want these? to add a double one? You can add right. a double one as you cut it so beautifully. Perfect, thank you. That goes into the oven, 40 to 50 minutes, uh, 160. And when it comes out, it looks a little bit like this. Mm -hmm. So you have there your lovely little half banana mm -hmm. on top. Mm -hmm. Eamon, can you pass that melted chocolate? Mm -hmm. And because it is the weekend, because we want to sort of make it look lovely and pretty... Treat. ..and a spoon, please, we're going to drizzle that extra chocolate on. And then... While I do that, Ruth, if you want to sprinkle over some of our toasted, flaked coconut. So then you've got. Have you tasted this yourself? Yeah, just so in that's a dry, the raw dry one. frying pan. You get mm -hmm. that lovely golden colour, and then some of the others. These are like three of my favourite things: bananas, know, coconut, too. and chocolate. Mine What's too. not to like there? And then we have our finished article. So you can go with the chocolate warm, 
or finished Ooh, when it's all dried and lovely. And this is a really nice one to do at the weekend. It can be done in muffins, mm -hmm. so you might need a little bit less time cooking. Rylan's on his feet. The rise. I'm up. He's Rylan's on his feet. Doesn't matter if it doesn't rise too much because I like this. It's stodgy. It's, it's warm. Yeah. There's it's a nice cup of tea. Place, Perfect. I'm glad you said I'd tea. I'd like that with a Rylan, nice cup like of tea. tea. Oh yeah, I'll do a little tea. Oh thanks. A little bit cake. That is perfect tea. That's in the afternoon. And that's exactly how. Not even cut it straight. What are you doing? Well, you're just so predictable with everything, that's why. Oh, you're going on a <laughs> diagonal cut? Yes. Oh, I feel like Mary Berry on Friday. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm so sorry, Candice. It should be about it's, presentation. It's absolutely fine. This is how versatile this cake is. You can cut it diagonally, <laughs> you can cut it in half. Yeah, so tea, tea, tea and cake. Tea. That's a perfect cake to right? have with a cup of tea. Yeah. That don't Sunday feel afternoon. naughty either. It's delicious. No. Don't it's feel too naughty. naughty. Thank you very much you indeed. So We've all gone bananas. Yeah.